Hi everyone, I am doing a kind of weekend vlog. So it's going to be very scrapbook um, orientated. Um, and I thought I'd kickstart it with a sort of little haul from Hey Little Magpie. I received it in the post uh, today, lunchtime, it's Thursday today. Um, so I will show you what I, I got. I received everything in a box, it looks like a big pizza box. Um, Right, so I got some little bits, Valentina. They are just little, little tiny stickers, all to do with Valentine's Day, which I thought would be good for my project life for last year because I haven't done anything for Valentine's Day. <sighs> Sorry, big yawn. Um, they, Valentina, how much were they? Uh, they were only seventy four p then, so they were nice and cheap. Um, the next thing I got, which is for my 2016 project life. I'm quite liking doing it in 6x8, so I'm going to stick with it. Um, this is the 6x8 Snap Designer Binder. It's literally just a black um, D-ring laminated binder, metal corners, metal book plate here. As you can see, apologies for the dogs. Sorry about that, but they want a treat. So, gravy van? Yeah? Do you want one? Is that going to keep you quiet here? Wait, you just had one. You're not even eating them. You're going to eat them? Or not? Apparently not. So, yeah, as I was saying, I've got this binder. This this was 9 99 and this is going to be my 2016 one. So it's got quite a nice inside, little polka dots. Obviously, my last year's one was burlap um, material. And this one, So they kind of contrast next to each other quite nicely. They do this one on Halo or Magpie in loads of different colours. But I thought this was more me for this year. So that's that. As I said, 9 99 I also had to get some more pocket pages because I am running low. Um, I decided to add a few more of the six by eight pocket pages so this is the becky higgins design one pocket pages um you get 12 in here this was the i to be honest i don't not massive fan of the becky higgins pocket pages because i find them really thin and cheap quality compared to the snap ones um i also did get some snap ones here but i got the insta pockets because i like the fact that you get a six by four print and then you get i think they're two by two yeah so four by six and then two by two. So I quite like this style because I take a lot of Instagram photos. So I thought it's handy to print them off small and get, obviously I can put journaling here or a photo. So, and they look like this. So I got them. Um, these are much better quality than Becky Higgins, but I always find the snap ones are really hard to get hold of. Um, but as I was saying, I want to do more big six by eight prints in my, um, albums because I quite like it like holiday photos it's nice to have a big like scenic picture in there um they were the Becky Higgins ones were $4.99 and the Simple Stories ones were $3.99 so you get 12 in there and you get what did you get oh you get 10 in this one so they're quite good um price you get quite a lot in there the other things I got were I got some washi tape just some one with little teacups on and then I got one with arrows like this both of them so the teacup one teacup teacup where are you teacup one was you're rudely interrupted again teacup one was 239 and the rain the no, rainbow um what's it called arrows was also 239 so same price just this is a thin tape that's a thicker one um, and then the next lot of things I got was papers so I'm a sucker for paper I do love to get them so this is a basic grey hillside it's a terranium I just thought this was the cutest paper ever I've done in my 2015 album I actually did um, some succulent plants and planted them so that will be really good paper to go with it this one was 89p the back of it is just like a it's a light baby pink colour kind of like little square tiles the next one is a Valentina so it goes with the little bit stickers it's Bella Boulevard I think it says um, so it's just like a big cut out sheet I guess so you've got all different like these will go perfectly in um, this 
they'll go like the little two by two squares here will go perfectly like if I wanted to put them in little pockets like that and same as that six by eight no six by eight six by four so that'll go in the other one um so these will fit all different types of pockets and again this one was 89p as well I think um the back of this one which I probably won't be using it's just oh no actually I might use that that's really cute it's just little hearts and every now and then it says love you that's cute the next one is this by we are we are memory keepers and it's crush it's this one xoxo crush i like this one this one's really cute although it does look a little bit like blood a bit morbid <laughs> and the back of it is like little circle squiggly things that one was also 89p i think Oh, I can't stop yawning. Right, that one was... Um, I completely lied. So the papers are away to 9p, but I didn't realise this was actually £1.50. That's quite expensive for them little stickers. Didn't realise that. Um, and then I got two sheets of this really cool pineapple paper. So this is basic grey sunkissed, and it's a tropic paper like line range or whatever it is. I absolutely love basic grey and I think they do the best papers so they're my faves absolutely loving the pineapples my friend is obsessed with them so I'm gonna be making her a present out of these um, it just has that basic sort of background on it but I mean overall I got quite a few bits of paper I got my new album for next year I've recently printed off all of my photos from photo box because they had a 50% um, off code and it was no minimum spend so I thought it would be a really good idea just to get all of my things printed um, and I got where did I get them um, I got all of this so I got a packet here packet here got some prints there got loads of prints there printing some pictures off my cousin um, I'm still waiting on two 6x8 prints, which for some reason haven't arrived, so I think I'm going to have to chase them up, because I did pay for fast delivery and they haven't arrived yet, which is not very good for fast delivery. Other than that, they are a brilliant service to use. I mean, I've never, I haven't have got any complaints with Photobox. I think they're really good. Um, and, yeah, I mean, I've just done my usual where... Hang on, let's find... Well, that's fine. There we go. I've done my usual where I've printed, like, little... I've done a 4x6 but used um, a collage and made it into loads of 2x2 two two, so then I can cut them out and use them in my um, pages for the snap. Uh, Jesus, sorry, I can't stop me yawning. In the page with the snap pocket pages. So that was it. So what I'm going to be doing tomorrow is um, having a day off and then on Saturday I've got my friend coming over. And we're going to have a scrapbook day, so I'll show you some more then. Bye! Morning everyone, it's Friday and it's uh, quarter past, no, ten past nine. I've been awake since uh, <laughs> quarter to eight because the dogs won't stop barking. I look like I have a mullet. <laughs> now they decide to be quiet. Vinny, are you barking? Are you driving me crazy? Are you driving <sighs> me crazy? Little git. Where's Diesel? He's in the blankets on the floor, eating the toy. You naughty dogs. Naughty. Yeah, I'm trying to lay in bed because I've had really bad stomach ache. I just want to relax, but they won't let me. No. I'm getting ready. 
Um, I'm going to meet my cousin and the twins for lunch and to play in the park. She's going with a few other friends. So I'm just getting ready. Basically, I've just shoved on um, some... What am I wearing? The Roche Posay CC... Yeah, CC cream. It's got SPF 30 in it. It's not particularly good weather today, but it's my kind of go-to thing for the summer because I don't want to get, like, burnt on my face or anything like that. Um... Yeah, I'm just shoving some makeup on, so got my I kind of look like a fat squid today, but I've got like these uh, can't show you like harem trousers from Next that I did in my um my haul in one of my last videos. So I've used the camera wrong. I keep looking over there when I should be looking down there for the camera. So I'll carry on getting ready and I'll be back with you. Right, I look as good as I'm gonna look, so well, minus the fact that I haven't done anything with my hair yet. But, so, um, I will check in with you um, in a bit. Are you on your scooter? Just walking the dogs, just got in from being with my cousin and I'm taking the dogs for their little afternoon walkies. All they want to do is eat grass. So we've been walking for a little bit because they need to go for a wee. And, um, we basically went to a park that we'd never been to before so the my little cousins had some time running around it was a really cool park don't ever get anything like that one didn't ever get anything like that when i was a kid had like a scooter bit so they can go around leave that come on so they could go around on their scooters like a little road they had um what did they have they had like loads of climbing stuff really cool like play uh what's it called climbing frame everything it's amazing and then we went and had a pub lunch which you would have seen in the clip before I had a me uh, veggie burrito which is really nice come on and um yeah it was really good to see my cousin and the baby bought her a little toy and she was loving it so I had a really good time so I'm gonna carry on my walk now come on let's go come on your own time Good evening, we're getting ready for the weekend here on Eagle Radio. We've got some big songs coming your way. Beautiful South to play for you. The song of the moment from Justin Timberlake as well. And right now we're going back to the 80s with Giorgio Moroda and Phil Oakey together in Electric Dreams. I want to know what you're up to this weekend. Let us know on the text 07799 Who are you up to? The country boys had a hard time adjusting to the bright lights of the big city. Sometimes there's a little bit of a culture shock, like the time we had them deliver a tank to the heart of New York City. Hey you! Get the hell out of the road! You want me to run your ass over or what? Dude, I could have drove a horse to go this fast. I could have too! A horse is a lot smaller than a 26 foot truck! Riding horses and tractors on the highways from the park here. But he's learning. You know, right next to real slow on the floor, you know that, right? It's not like he's riding a horse or something. Blowing in like a deer antler. All right. Very special to help make the transition from backwards to civilization a little bit easier. It's very happy chappy. Eight was four tragedies. Every big taste among the monks. I've got a lot to thank you for. He's my dad. Personalized cars and great ideas from me. Oh, little pack. Yeah, 
Trying to get closer to my hand. <laughs> okay, he's on the phone. And we've gone up here. It's taken. Uh, excuse me, you'll fall off the picture frame. They're very naughty. Crazy rats. So we're back from doing food shopping, um, went to Sainsbury's, they've got a Starbucks there, so we grabbed a Starbucks each, Mike had a Java chip, I had a cookie dough one, which was really nice. Just trying to suss out how to use their app, which is completely different from Costa's, but I'm giving it a go. Um, so now I'm just collecting up all the washing to get it ready for the week. Most of it's done, except Mike's work clothes, which is what the task for today is. If I can find it all. That's where I put it. It's a dirty top. Another thing I got at Sainsbury's was this weekly planner. It was only five pound. It's like a it feels fabricy, but it's not. Um, and it's just got the days of the week. And when you flip it over, it has like to do a notes. So I thought this would be quite handy for keeping me on track with the thing I need to do at home and catching up with things that I want to do like my scrapbook and YouTube. I figure if I plan it in I'll actually get it done rather than just forgetting or procrastinating and not bothering. So yeah I'm just doing that. I've got a nice big jug of water with lemon and lime on the go in my uh, Primark mason jar. It says let's do cocktails. So yeah that's all that's really happening today. Just the dogs are chilling. I think me and Mike are going to watch a film. Might do a bit more scrapbooking. And that's about it. So whatever we do later, I'll uh, check in and let you know. 